in this question we are told that ABC is a triangle such that BC is equal to 5 units and D is the foot of the perpendicular from A to BC. So, let us assume that this is how the triangle ABC is. This is A, this is B and this is C. We are drawing a perpendicular from A to BC. Let us assume that this is D. The length of BC is 5. E is a point on CD such that BE, A, this is D. BE is 3 centimeters. So, let us assume that this is E. B is 3. So, if you assume that BD is P, what is the value of DE? DE will be 3 minus P because BE is equal to 3. So, now we can actually calculate the length of CE. CE will definitely be equal to 2. Why is C equal to 2? Because BE we are told is equal to 3. Now, what we are required to calculate is the value of AB square minus AE square plus 6CD. So, we have AE square over here. What is AB square? Because this is a perpendicular, AB square is equal to AD square plus BD square. What is AE square? AE square is equal to AD square plus DE square. So, the value of AB square minus AE square is equal to BD square minus DE square. What is BD square minus DE square? This is of the form X square minus Y square. So, this is equal to BD plus DE into BD minus DE. But we know the value of BD plus DE. That is simply equal to BE which is equal to 3. And what is BD? BD is equal to P. We assume that this is equal to P units. This is P minus what is DE? DE is 3 minus P. This is equal to 3 into 2p minus 3 which is equal to 6p minus 9. That is the value of ab square minus a square. What is the value of 6 times cd? What is the value of cd? cd is equal to 3 minus p plus 2 which is equal to 5 minus p. This is the value of cd. So, 6cd will be equal to 30 minus 6p. So, 6cd plus AB square minus AE square is the sum of 30 minus 6P plus 6P minus 9 which is equal to 21. Because minus 6P gets cancelled with 6P, you are left with 30 minus 9 which is equal to 21. So, the answer for this question is option E. If you are looking for a ZAT crash course, just google search crack you ZAT crash course.